I just wish we'd put a slight, slightest bit or the tiniest bit effort in going after the criminals and the bad guys with the guns. This is 500 pages of New Jersey law on the books now that doesn't impact one criminal, only the law-abiding citizens. Everything we're doing here today, making it possible in the bill to sue the gun manufacturers, we all know who it is. We all know who it's the criminals. It's the ones who's arrested dozens of times, many, many times. And now we want to put more litigation and go after the gun manufacturers. And I imagine it's a national um, movement. But what about the firearms that are, you think the law-abiding citizens and hunters, their guns are made by different companies than our law enforcement? You think it's made by different companies than our military? What are we trying to do going after the gun manufacturers who are, are making weapons that are defending our country? Boy, I imagine what the people in Ukraine must be thinking, and they're begging for firearms as Putin's overthrowing their country. It's not the law-abiding citizens, folks, that you have to worry about. When someone goes to rob a liquor store or carjack you, they're not flipping through these 500 pages to see what they might do wrong. Maybe I forget my ID card, maybe I don't have my gun locked up. They don't give a crap about what's in this book. So all these bills and all your feel-good stuff today is nonsense. You know it. You're going after law-abiding citizens who are doing nothing wrong but taking their kids hunting, taking their kids shooting, and shame on you. The Supreme Court has just ruled. I know the Supreme Court, when they're in your favor, it's good, but God forbid they make a, a statement that the Second Amendment is one of the most enshrined rights that we have. Now, also, the Supreme Court's no good. But let me tell you something, folks. Half of these pages, I hope, are going to be torn out of the book with that Supreme Court re, um, uh, vote. And we're passing bills. We're so anxious to get on the TV screen or to, to appeal to some group on, on shootings that we're willing to pass bills that we probably know are illegal and not even going to stand up to test the time. So why don't you take a fraction, a fraction of your effort and go after the bad guys and the criminals that are doing the carjackings, that are carrying the guns, and leave the damn law-abiding citizens alone and give them a break because they're just trying to protect their family, go hunting, and do their target shooting and enjoy themselves. And you people are just hell-bent on going after the good guys rather than the bad guy. Shame on you. I urge you to vote no, and you should have voted no on all the damn gun bills. Thank you very much.